In this video, let's have a look at the top 7 major changes in iOS 16. Watch this video till the end and let's begin. The first major change is in the lock screen. You will see a new lock screen on iOS 16. With the lock screen, you will see a new animation. And on the lock screen at the top, you will see a lock icon. And when you show the face ID, the lock icon will be gone. And you can access the notifications at the bottom. This is really amazing. And just like Apple Watch, uh, you can customize the wallpapers directly from the lock screen. You don't have to go to the settings app. Just long press the lock screen. Just long press the lock screen. And here you can customize the locks, you can customize the wallpaper. So just tap on customize. If you want to change the wallpaper, you can change the wallpaper as per your liking. And if you tap on the clock icon, you can, you can change the font as per your requirement. You can even change the colors. You can even customize the widgets. Just tap on the widget icon. You can remove or add widget as per your liking. Now just tap on done. Now let's have a look at the other features of the lock screen. Just tap on add new. Here you can add your pictures as wallpaper and this is going to give you an amazing depth effect. You can add a natural image or you can even add black and white image. You can enable or disable the depth effect. Now tap on done. Now another major change is present in the photos app. If you open the photos app, open any picture of your choice. Now you can long press and hold the object and it will automatically convert the image into a PNG. And now open the open any social media or app of your choice. Now you can send it to any of your friend on any social media platform. This is really amazing. I really like this feature. And another another major change is present in the photos app itself. Open open any video, you can access the uh, live captions. Previously, the live captions were available only, if, only in the Photos app. Now, the live captions are available in the video app as well. Just pause the video. Long press it. Here you will see an option of copy. So, select the text as per your requirement and copy the text. So, this is how you copy the text from a video. Another major change is present in the messaging app. Open the messages app on your iPhone. Open any conversation. Here, you can edit the sent messages on iPhone. Let me show you an example. Hello, Johnny. So I have sent a text, hello, Johnny. Now just long press and hold it. Here you will see an option of edit. Just tap on edit. Hello, John. So this is how you can edit the sent messages on iPhone. And if you want, you can even undo the sent messages. Again, long press and hold the message and tap on undo send. This will remove the sent messages. This is similar to the delete, uh, delete sent messages on WhatsApp. So this was about the messages app. Another great feature is the dictation, which is you, you can, you can find it along with the keyboard. So at the bottom, you'll see a mic icon, just tap on that and this will open the dictation and this will start typing the messages on your iPhone. This is again, another handy feature in the messages app or iOS 16. While tapping the message, you can even use the keyboard. This is how you can use the keyboard and the dictation simultaneously on any app. So this was about the dictation feature. Another major change is present in the maps. 
So open the Apple Maps. Here you, here you will see a new city view. In the Apple Maps, you are going to see a new city view. Also, the Apple Map is now available available in many more countries. So this was about the Apple Maps. And the next major feature is the fitness. Previously, the fitness app was available only for Apple Watch users. Now the fitness app is available for all the iPhone users. Apple, is Apple, Apple will be using iPhone to track the fitness behavior of any individual. And the last and the seventh major change is with the search bar. Here on the home screen, you are going to see a search icon. Just tap on that and it will open the search bar. And with the search bar, you are going to see um, a minor change with the keyboard. I really like this keyboard. So these were the seven major changes in iOS 16. Let me know which one is your favorite in the comments down below. So that's it about the video guys. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video and if you did, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to this channel for more videos like this.